He felt that because of the opposition from the two major newspapers of the county, uh, because of the opposition of numerous citizens who we felt uh, were influential uh, and who were sincere and conscientious about the matter, that it should be re uh, considered uh, as uh, uh, not feasible at this time. We were in a flight of three, and the two aircraft up ahead of me apparently brushed wingtips, causing one craft to violently roll out of control, whereupon it stuck underneath the other fuselage, causing both aircraft to go out of control, making them spin all the way down to the ground, having already burst into flame at our flight altitude of 3,500 feet. What was the weather like up there, Joe? The weather was good VFR, ceiling seven to 8,000 feet with visibility of more than 10 miles. How far did the aircraft fall in ground miles from the time they broke? They seemed to go almost straight down. Almost straight down. Yes, uh, did the aircraft fall fire before they come around? Yes, they, they burst into flame upon the impact. How far was your aircraft from at the time? I was flying what I consider a say quarter of a mile behind them. That's a bank of tape recorders here in the police communications section under the command of Captain B.K. Hipskin. Captain Hipskin just got these tape recorders installed. Captain, how are they going to work now? We have uh, four banks of dual taping equipment. And each one of the banks, each, each uh, set of tapes records eight voice tracks. The way they will work, we have one bank for each of our sets of telephones and one bank for the radio frequencies. The top section of this bank is a permanent record that we will maintain and file. The lower bank is what we call an instant replay. Who has access to these tapes? Uh, well, just the department. They'll be kept and filed for us and they will not be available to anybody. Do you think they're going to be an effective weapon against crime? Yes, uh, as a matter of fact, they have many applications that uh, we've been working with, such as training our people so that they can handle calls from the public quicker, more easily. the juvenile officer, Mr. Lynn Ross, to uh, investigate the feasibility of providing quarters for the uh, juveniles to be held temporarily with 24-hour uh, supervision uh, and to report back to us so that we could take it up with Commissioner's Court and with the proper authorities. That is, he is to investigate with the sheriff in cooperation with the sheriff. I think that that is the, going to be the temporary uh, effort to uh, adequately uh, take care of these delinquents rather than have something happen that would be uh, tragic. 